Hi everybody, this is Mike Herzing with In Wheel Time. This week we're driving the Infiniti QX70. It's the 3.7, the all-wheel drive version. You know, Infiniti's kind of done a lot of changing with the JX and all the different, uh, all the G models and everything. Now they've gone to the SUVs are now QX. Now this is a nice vehicle. Uh, it's sporty. It handles good. It, if you're looking for a cushy ride, this ain't it. If you want some performance and you want some sexy looks, eh, this might be it. Just the vehicle for you. This vehicle's got some nice lines to it. It's typically got the typical sexy LEDs in the front and rear. It looks real good. Lots of room in it. Kind of a whoopty swoopty, you know, roof line, so it isn't gonna have really the room that most people think it might. But uh, as far as trunk space, take a look at this. Lots of performance too. Seats will fold down. Got a full size spare. Notice that the Bose speaker is right there in the center. That's one thing, it seems got a heck of a boom box. Where are you gonna put it? Well, guess what? In the well for this wheel, you can put a lot of speaker. And this one is a lot of speakers. Great, it's great sound in this vehicle. You know, Nissan's been doing that on all their vehicles and I think it's really great. Oh, there are no bad infinities. This thing is a good looking interior. Got a lot of controls here. Notice the pleats, notice the color of the interior. is kind of a chocolate brown. This is kind of a burgundy colored or black cherry colored vehicle. Really pretty, I tell you what. Stitching, fit and finish is superb on this vehicle. Headroom on, this, on the back, second, you know, second row, still pretty decent. They couldn't, certainly couldn't do a third row with it though. The trim on, on these things is really nice. I just love the colors here. It's very deep, uh, very chocolatey. This one's got all the bells and whistles. This one has also the, the crash mitigation and I think it even has a deal with it. You know, they talk about some of the uh, models here will have a, the, the thing set up where somebody crashes in front of you, the car in front of you, uh, it'll start to, to uh, do it for you. This thing has the crash mitigation. If you don't hit the brakes and it senses a crash, you don't hit the brakes, it waits a second and then it hits them for you. It has uh, the, the uh, radar uh, active cruise control, it's got everything else. Basically the car that almost drives itself, but not quite. It is a nice taut ride, it is good performance. Everything you want to know on it is really good. Also, it has heated and, and cooled seats, all the nice interior pieces. One thing I did wish it had, it had more presets for the radio, but that's pretty simple. Under the hood, you're going to find Nissan's famous V6, 3.7 liter, 325 horsepower, 267 pounds of torque. It's got intelligent all-wheel drive, and it's got snow mode, which doesn't do us a whole lot of good here in Texas. 7-speed automatic transmission, shifts very well. Uh, this thing performs very, very well. This thing will flat scoot, let me tell you what. Fuel economy is 22 highway, uh, 16 city, 18 combined, eh, it probably gets that. I've been driving a little bit faster and I probably wouldn't, you know, but, you know, this is a nice car. It's got all the bells and whistles, has all the electronics. You know, the, the, uh, the QX70, the all-wheel drive model, starts at about 46. If you get the technology package with all the cruise control and the lane departure warning and prevention and intelligent brake assistant, forward collision warning and da-da-da-da-da, so on and so on, that's an extra $2,950. This one also has the deluxe touring package, an extra $3,300, and it has the premium package, which is another $4,300. So this makes this vehicle $57,945. You know what, it puts it in pretty rarefied air, but if you want a performance import that's, that's super, super reliable, handles good, fun to drive, this is not a Lexus, folks, this is an Infiniti, it's fun to drive, check out the Infiniti QX70. Now, if you're looking for a smooth ride, a big cushy thing that's gonna float down the road like a boat, this ain't it. This is a very fun car to drive. I give it a four and a half out of five stars, I just love it. This is Mike Herzing with In Wheel Time. You can find us on Facebook at Facebook forward slash In Wheel Time or, of course, go to InWheelTime.com. See you soon.